Hey guys, it's Zara, and for today's video, I will be unboxing this Yes Style package. So, just to get out of the way, yeah, I know there's like stains on my hand. I literally just filmed my unboxing for the Monster X and Tony Molly collection, so that's why and I was doing swatches. And Tony Molly did not come out to play when it came with these. Oh my god, I don't know how I'm going to get these off. <laughs> but anyway, so... Somebody that I follow on Instagram was doing a giveaway where you could win a hundred dollar gift card thing to the yes style and obviously I entered and me and one other girl won and um the person's name is Wilson. I'll leave all his links down below because you guys should follow him. He's amazing, he's funny, and he's really good looking. To Wilson, you are very generous. Freaking a hundred dollars, like oh my god. So yeah, now the only thing is I bought two articles of clothing, so I don't know how it's going to fit in this box, and I bought a lot of beauty, mainly K-Beauty, because, you know, yeah. But, obviously, it was 100 US dollars, so Canadian dollars and US dollars. <laughs> Literally, it could be 6 bucks and go up to, like, $8 for Canada. So, yeah, let's just see. Yeah. I'll leave down below exactly how much everything costs and links to everything. Easier than talking about it. So... But before I do, I went over like $14. So, you know, obviously I could not buy it for $100. I, I'm not shocked that I went over like $14. So, like, yeah, I'm not shocked. But yeah, let's just, let's just open this thing up. So sorry about my hair. It's just, I'm, I'm burning and I just filmed another video. And I was trying to get the damn swatches off. And bitch, as you can tell, they didn't want to come off. Okay. Oh, I see one of my clothes. Now, I have heard that on Yeso, you gotta be careful with what you buy when it comes to clothing. But, as you can tell, here's everything. So, what is it? So, the first thing... <gasps> Yay! It's a sweater! Oh my god! I see the picture and it's so cute! So, I ordered this really cute sweater. I'll throw up a picture right here. And, like, as you can tell, it's freaking cute. So, I got this in a large. And again, they're, I believe, Asian sizing. So... And if you know, Asian sizings run very small. So, yeah, I tried to make sure that I got it in the right order. I hope I did. But, oh my god, this is so cute! I really hope this is not small on me, because this is so freaking cute. Gosh. And, uh, of course, it's small. Yep, it's... This is, like, gonna be a crop top on me. Damn it! And the material feels okay. Like, it doesn't feel super cheap, but... Oh, it's so cute! But... Oh, it doesn't even have pockets. It's not, is it a sweater or a sweatshirt? I think it's a sweatshirt. Cause, wait, I thought it's supposed to have pockets on it. Oh, whatever. Anyway, so on the arms it says no and yes. But let's just... I'll just show you. But it's, it's like a crop top. It's literally going to be a crop top on me. Ugh. I don't want to return it. Because this took forever to get here. It took almost like a month, I think, to get here. I don't know why it took so long. And I think I paid express shipping too, so... Did I? I don't know. But like, here's a little print on it, but it's so cute. Can you like see? Like, look. I hope you guys can see, but like, yeah. So it's like that, and then it has like the drawstrings, and then a hoodie, and then the arms. It's like so cute, but this is not gonna fit me. Aw, oh, man, now I'm sad, because I already know that my other thing is not gonna fit either, thinking about what size I bought. Ugh! Good thing I only bought two. Okay, so here's the sweater, and as you can tell, it's so short. I, I'm not shocked. I had a feeling it was like, it's honestly, when this shrinks, I feel like it's going to go like here. And it's really sad because, like, look how cute it is. Like, it's so cute. It's, it's so cute, but bitch. Mm -mm, I can't. I'd have to pretty much give this to my sister. It's one of my sisters, because it's so small. Even I bet it wouldn't fit one of my sisters either. Maybe not even my brother. And he's pretty small. Oh, <sighs> but it's so cute. This, yeah, the two pieces of clothing I'm gonna have to return and get bigger sizes. But like, bitch, they're so cute. <sighs> yeah, I'm not really shocked that they're small. I had a feeling that even though I checked, they would be small and they're small. But hey, at least I know what it looks like. Now I just gotta get a bigger size. And it's actually a pretty nice material. Like, it feels nice. I feel like uh, if I had something under it, it would keep me warm and stuff. So, yeah. Wait a minute. 
I swear I should remember. Did I? I thought I got two pieces, two lip colors. Whatever. Anyways, so yeah, here it is. Small. So here's the other shirt. So it's like a blouse. Damn, it's cute. I got it in a large as well. It looks like I had to buy like triple large or something. Like, what the hell, man? I even did the sizing. I'm like, it should fit me. <sighs> Where's the opening case? Yeah, I think I'm gonna return them because I really want these and I really want them to fit. The sweater honestly looks like it would fit one of my little sisters, but so let us open this. Okay, this feels really interesting. Yeah, this is small as well. <laughs> this is just uh, like I don't even think this is gonna cover my butt. And if you're wondering, I'm like five foot, so I'm pretty short. But I do I do have a lot of a, uh, I have a pouch. A kangaroo pouch, so but anyways, this is really cute. Uh, right here on the collar has like a little carrot. And then if you can see right there, there's a little bunny rabbit. Oh, it's see-through. <laughs> That's fine. But there's like a little bunny rabbit. And it's... I feel like this might cover my butt a little bit. Like this one, I think I can get away with. This sweater, however, I don't know. And it doesn't... Like it feels warm, but not warm enough for Canada. Yeah, I'm from Canada. So... And if you're also Canadian, you know what I mean when it, when I say it's not going to be warm enough. But this is cute. I just don't like how it's see-through. But I'll do try-ons after. Just not right now. So here is the blouse thing. So as you can tell, it is honestly... This is... I don't know. Like, it covers, but I honestly can tell from the material that this is going to shrink a lot when I wash it. So I also don't... It kind of makes me feel itchy. Like, the material kind of makes me feel itchy. But, like... It's so cute, but I'm going to return this and get a bigger size because I do want this. I just don't like how small it is. It's definitely really small on me. So I'm going to definitely return this, get something, get it a bigger size. Oh, and here we have all the beauty, but I don't like how this is like all bunched up. I honestly feel like this could easily get broken and ruined, but if you can see inside the box, they're all just like together, which I don't really like that it's packaged that way, especially with how much I paid for this. Well, actually I only paid $14, but like still. But anyways, oh, I gotta be careful. So here's all of the beauty products that I got. I got quite a lot. Honestly, I went back and watched Ivan's videos on his skin recommendation, like skincare, and that's why I bought all this. So I'm like, bitch, I need stuff. So. That's why I have so much skincare because I have really bad skin. But I also am really bad when it comes to skincare, so. Okay. Oh, yeah, I also got two lip thingies. So, the first thing is the Peri Peri Ink, the Airy Velvet, in number four, beautiful coral pink. So, it's one of these. Oh, it's just like in this cool little packaging. Um, in I'm in a like Korean Student Association club because why not? And I remember watching, oh, this is actually really cute in person. Um, I know one of the girls in the club was, I think she was wearing this. I cannot remember if it was this actual brand or something similar to this, but it looks really pretty. So I'm like, why not? She said that it was good. So I think it was this one, but so it looks like this. This is just what it looks like. It kind of looks like um, somewhat of like a medicine bottle. I don't know, but yeah. So this one is in a uh, beautiful coral pink, I believe so. I'm just gonna open it. I'm not gonna swatch. Should I swatch it? Oh, it's a nice color. So I'm just gonna swatch it right here. Oh, should I? Because, like, I feel like it will contradict. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna. Ah! I'm gonna swatch it right under here. Oh, that feels nice. It feels like a matte lipstick, but that's a nice color actually. So you can't really tell, but here's the color. It's a really nice color, and like, it definitely feels like matte, and it feels really nice, and it just looks really nice. So yeah, like. Well, just rubbed it off a little bit but it's still there so this is actually a really cute color i can't wait to wear this where's the packaging <laughs> oh here so i'm just gonna put it back i believe i bought two just two lip kit two lipsticks or two of these i know i think i bought only two from that brand but uh, oh yeah and i also got two free gifts so i got this free i believe it was a memo pad but it's like in a milk carton so it's like really cute let's open this up so it's like just like inside this like little milk carton which is really cute honestly i love that packaging and i believe it's just um memo pads or like notepads i can't remember exactly but it was just something that i got for free because i think i pay because of the amount that i got in money like how much i paid something. whatever i don't know but let's just open this 
Oh yeah, it's just um little. Oh, it's cute. It's like little sticky pads. Oh, it's kind of ruined. Oh, it's not sticky pads. Oh, it's just like little pieces of paper. Oh, and it's different colors as well. It's cute. So they just look like. Oh wait, no. I think it's just the same color. Just thought it look. <laughs> thought it looked different. Can't really see, but that's just what it looks like. That's cute. Personally, I don't think I would buy this. Like just on its own. I'm kind of happy that it was free. Cause I this is just not something I would actually buy for myself. Cause I don't know I don't like writing on really small scraps of paper. Ah, oh my God, how am I gonna get this back in? Wait, ah, did I ruin the box? Wait, itch. Ah, no, no, no. Okay. Wait, how does this? Oh my God, this box is cute though. Okay, I got it. Just gonna put these back in. All right, next, let us open. Oh, it's Laneige. Oh, yeah, I I definitely bought this because of Ivan. Wait, is this the lip one? Ivan raves about this, uh... Oh, yeah, definitely. It's just the small ones. Um, the... This, uh, what is it called? Lip sleeping mask? And it's a small one. Oh, my God. This is, like, travel size. What the fuck? I did not think it was to be this small. Anyways, good thing to try out. So, he always raves about the pink one. I don't know if it looks exactly like this, but it's a lip sleeping mask and he says it's really good and it really moisturizes your lips. So I got just these two little packs. I think it's cheaper together. So can't wait to use these, but they're way... Why is the pink one so much smaller than the blue one? I don't know how I feel about the smell of this. Wait. Like it has a nice smell, but then there's just this weird hint of something that makes it... That like ruins the smell, but... They're really small and cute, though. Let's see if this one smells. Oh, this one? Okay, I don't like the smell of this one. Okay, that's weird. They're both really different. Wait, they're both water? Oh, okay, this one, liquidy. This one is, like, solid. Okay, I was, like, confused. I thought they were both um, liquid. Because this one says water sleeping mask. This one just says lip sleeping mask. Oh, wait, is this one not a lip sleeping mask, but this one is? Wait, I'm confused. I'm going to have to look up. The difference between these but yeah and everything's in like korean so i can't really look at the ingredients but i'm actually learning korean right now so hey maybe i actually could find out what it is but i'm not that good yet another thing this was it ivan or was it eddie i looked at eddie and or edward and um ivan's videos because they both recommend a lot of skincare so i can't remember if this was both of them or one of them but i got this deep oh shoot it's in korean um okay wait what was this again i think this was a oh it's a treatment oil so it's like a cleansing oil i believe oh pfft. i'm so stupid it says it here in english uh yeah so this is the so soft meal soft meal <laughs> which i don't know how to pronounce that uh deep cleansing oil can't remember who it was they said this is really good so i'm gonna use it but yeah, this is literally what all this is. Oh, and I think I got one or did I get one or two? Oh, I forgot I got this. Oh, anyways, I think I only got an one free um, what is it? Face mask. Again, I got one free memo pad and one free face mask. It was just some random one, and apparently I have green tea. So yeah, I'll be honest, I really don't use face mask because I'm lazy and I never just I never find the time. So. This one, I know for a fact, oh, actually, I don't, actually, I think Wilson uses this. I think Eddie and Ivan do, and it's, I know a lot of people use this, and it's raved out. It's the Lemon Sparkling Peeling Gel, so this one, if I can remember properly, if I can remember, this one, I believe when you put it on, it actually, like, just starts peeling. Like, it's not a face mask, it's just a gel that, once you put it on, it, like, starts peeling, and, like, you can, I guess that's, like, the, it's the disc dead skin or is it the actual product i don't know but once you like rub it in stuff you'll see like white little flakes coming off and stuff i think it's both your dead skin and this working together so that just sounds like something i really need so next i got something that honestly pretty much everybody talks about even my cousin uses this and i didn't even know that until i told her that i got this but so it is the cosrx acne pimple match <laughs> match master patch I think we all know what this is. It's literally just little pimple patches. Can't wait to use this because I am horrible when it comes to not touching my face. Like, literally, I honestly, when I'm bored or something, I'll just, like, s sit there and just start picking up my acne or, like, 
honestly during class i'll like sometimes go like this and like kind of like pop it which is i know disgusting but i can't help it. it's literally i'm just sitting there and just like okay i'm bored in class so i'll just like start doing that and i don't mean to it's just it's just a ha out of habit so i don't know if that's gonna fix it completely but i do also pop all my pimples even though i know you're not supposed to but i do even if they're the really painful ones like the ones that are hidden under i'll still try and pop them must be why i have so much acne scars but yeah hopefully this can help because i've been really wanting to try these and it's a lot smaller than i thought it was but either way i've been really wanting to try so this is the 24 pack next we have the coserx oh shoot how do you pronounce this centella blemish ampu i don't know how to pronounce that so this one it's supposed to i don't know again i actually have no idea what most of these are supposed to do that's why you go back and watch videos but i think ivan right what raves about this oh this is bigger than i thought it was and i know for a fact this was pretty expensive so this is what this so uh oh, not the best so here's what it looks like it's just like it looks green blue like in person it looks more greenish blue than it looks it's like clear and stuff but yeah so this is what it looks like it's the centella blemish a pew and pew i don't know but I like how it has this case cover on it. That's like a smart thing. But yeah. Next we have the Coserx Centella Blemish Cream. So again, I assume Ivan. I forget, but either Ivan or Eddie raves about this. Again, it's supposed to be really good. And I believe both this and the thing I showed last are supposed to be good for sensitive skin maybe. But just like this cute little packaging. This one is... 1.5 ounces and this one is 0 0.67 ounces fluid ounces this is ounces and this is fluid ounces interesting that these are different but anyways so i actually have a lot of cream so i don't know why i bought this but i could not choose like i literally when i told my friend that i was getting stuff from yes style she's like girl build your wish list and i I've seen, like, stuff on Yes Style before, but once I actually went and looked, <laughs> bitch, I wanted everything off that website, honestly, but I don't got that kind of money. So, yeah. Next is the Apu, Apu, I think that's the name of the brand, um, something sun, sun cream. I have no idea how to pronounce that, but it is an SPF 39, um, sunscreen, because I'll be honest, I pretty much never wear sunscreen. I'm just lazy. And I can never find good ones. And I don't like the way it feels on my skin. But, yeah, so I got this one. Again, I think Ivan raves about this. I can't remember who, but I believe it's Ivan. So, yeah. Hopefully this makes me wear sunscreen. So, here's what it looks like. So, we have one more thing that I honestly forgot that I bought. And it's this little uh, bunny headband. And I got this because... I need my hair out of my face when I'm washing my face. So I thought, hey, I see a lot of people using this and it's so cute. I hope this fits my head. Wait, let's just try it on. I'm wearing makeup, so it's gonna. Well, I'll do this better later. Okay, I actually think this will work. You guys are seeing me without my glasses. Ah, put them back on. Okay. Cute. Can you see? Little bunny rabbit ears. Aren't they cute? <laughs> oh, I'm actually happy I bought this. It's so cute. But, oh my god, my floor is a mess. But, that is all I bought. For $100, that's actually a pretty good $114. It's actually a pretty good amount. Oh, I have this stuff right here. Okay, so... Oh, it ripped. I got, in total, that was 13 things. I'm still sad about the two article clothings that, that don't fit me. Okay, so I have 14 days to return. So I think I'm almost up with my 14 days. Shit. But yeah, I'm going to definitely, if these, I'm going to try these on. If they don't fit the way I want them to, I am going to return them and try and get a bigger size. Which means I really hate dealing with returns. But anyways, so yeah, that's everything that I got. So I, I'm actually really happy. Again, thank you, Wilson and YesStyle, for hosting this giveaway. And I still cannot believe I got this. And honestly, uh, I want to buy so much from YesStyle. But definitely now I know to be extremely careful when it comes to clothing. Makeup and stuff, I feel like it's going to be okay. Clothing, however, 
yeah oh shoes i'm kind of happy i didn't buy shoes because that i don't want to deal with i have a big ass feet for a five foot girl so <laughs> dealing with that no but anyways um yeah i hope you guys like this unboxing don't forget to like comment and subscribe till next time